List view displays tests in a linear form, making it easy to track progress updates, update statuses, and prioritize and even communicate with your team about your tasks. So how do you make the most of list view? Let's talk about some best practices here. First, customize your view to match your workflow and only show relevant information. Add relevant columns and custom fields, such as a drop-down custom field or even a text field for an AI summary that integrates AI with your work. and apply filters to narrow down your tasks. And use grouping to organize tasks by statuses, priority, or even assignee, and much more. And last, you'll want to leverage me mode to see only the tasks that are assigned to you across various projects. You can even move to another view and me mode will still be enabled for you. Next, did you know that you can take bulk actions on your work? This will save you time and effort and cut down on manual work whenever you need to make changes to multiple tasks at once. Immediately update task attributes, due dates, and even move multiple tasks or add tasks to other lists with the click of a button. Once you've customized your list view, it's time to get work done. Easily work on your tasks at a high level on the list view by adjusting information such as statuses, assignees, due dates, priority, custom fields, and you can even post comments directly to your team. Okay, now that you've seen some great best practices associated with list view, go to the hands-on exercises attached to this course and try it for yourself.